Hi everyone, welcome to my haul of P. Louise. It's a kind of short one. I haven't done a haul video for a while actually, so I thought it would be good. Um, a cute little festive look that I've decided to do today as well. Um, and yeah, I wanted you to see some of the stuff that I've got in here. I've opened it just to make sure like everything's there, but um, I haven't actually checked out the stuff that's inside there. Yeah, I think this is the most stuff that I've bought from P. Louise. So let's have a look. I personally really like um, P. Louise because I think it's super pigmented. Um, everything came in a box like this. I didn't order it, like, I didn't order the box specifically. It just came with the box, if that makes sense. So, yeah, it's massive. It looks really cute. The packaging was really um, adorable. It just says, like, thank you for your order, babe. We love it, babes. All right, sorry. <laughs> um, and get ready to get obsessed. And then it's just on like some nice thing. So I feel like this is quite a good like gift as it is. Right, what else do we have? Wanna play a game? Send up, okay. There's a scratch card in here. Um, probably, okay, so win money, win the Christmas collection or win a hundred pound food shop. Okay, I might actually use that. So it's gonna be one of those ones that's like, oh, you've got a percentage of stuff. Here's 5%. <laughs> so yeah. So first things that I've got, which I'm really excited about. So I love, so I've been trying to do like more, um, like different looks as you can see. Um, and I noticed that the stuff that I'm using, especially when it comes to like black eyeshadow, black eyeliner, isn't as pigmented as I want it to be and it doesn't really stay so um I saw that um P. Louise has really good inks and also really good brushes as well for quite a cheap amount as well so this is the fresh ink comes in like this um has a brush um <laughs> All um, along these, uh, I don't know if there's tea or something um, else, but there's a P. Louise is cancelled. <laughs> um, and then um, this one is the white. So this is a re-white. I haven't used this, so I'm just going to open it up now. Um, it looks super thick. Oh, that comes out like really, really thick like that. So you're going to see how it comes out with a brush, um, like doing stuff on your face and on your, your hands. So it goes on the brush really easily. You don't really need that much of it. So on my hand, oh my God, like even just that one little bit, you leave a swipe and it goes on really well. I could literally, if I was painting my face, do so much of that. Um, if I... Yeah, that just, it's quite a creamy texture as well. Um, and yeah, the more you put on it, um, it looks a bit whiter. So yeah. Oh, that's that's just gonna be so good. With, and there's a lot of it on the brush, so that's like two swipes of it. And there's still like quite a lot left on the brush. Yes, I've put this all over my hands. <laughs> I don't know how it comes out. So yeah, that's that. I feel like that would last me a while. I didn't trust the process, so I got two of the blacks because I wanted. Um, I was going to use it for like eyeliner and also for um, looks like that I wanted to do with painting on my actual face or when I was doing stuff that would run into body. So I've got the black of this. I think I so I've got two whites and I've got two blacks. I apologize. I've already opened one black. So the black comes in the same case as it does with there. You've got the brush and then you've got the black ink as well. Um so I feel like this was quite a fair price. So if you could, I would um, get this. I'd check it out. My lighting's acting up a little bit. But if you could, I'd check this out. Um, the black is called Feed Black. 
Lol. <laughs> okay. So, so you can see the brush is a little bit used already. Um, it comes out just as creamy. You literally need, um, don't need that much. I'm checking the white which we've just used. Um, it hasn't really dried down that much. I think you would probably need some powder to help that. This is the, oh, that black, look at that, like it comes out. I already know my camera's like really good with picking up colours, shout out Agate. <laughs> but like look how black that is, oh that's so good. <sighs> Dark like my soul. <laughs> Cut my, oh my god. So, so far. This is what my hand's looking at. I literally don't watch swatch videos. Am I doing this right? Who knows? I'm not an MUA, I just like makeup. So, <laughs> well, this is the messy ass tutorial I'm gonna get, and that's okay. Um, right, so I also got some of the P. Louise paints. Let me see if I've got any. So these are just inside the box, um, as is. And then I've got, a brush I wanted a slanted brush because I wanted to try and do really sh sleek graphic liner um, looks um, and this is a brush that was recommended this one is number 125 and it looks like this so I wanted a good slanted brush so that I could um, practice doing like sharp liner looks because at the moment I do have one but it's a little bit too fluffy, it's not precision. Also, how are they doing that? I don't know, I'll like look at it and I'm like, how are you doing that so perfectly? This is surely like CGI'd on, but it's not. It's just that people are that good and I'm not. Um, but that's okay. Also, why am I trying to fit that back in? No, why am I trying to fit that back in because we're gonna wait let me try I just like things to be in their thing but it doesn't make sense so let me keep that that is done that is out so I have the yellow paint um the yellow cosmetic paint is it's basically mellow mustard um I wanted something that was like I'm really into the oranges and yellows at the moment and um I wanted something that would like pick up a lot with the yellows um, I'm also cautious about squeezing too much. When it comes out, it's looking a bit brownish. Um, it's looking more brown than mustard yellow, but I'll see. So it's like, this is the colour it, of it coming out. It's very thick. It's very thick. It literally doesn't need that much. Um, it's coming on and it's obviously not as like um, potent as the inked because I have to go back on it a few times for it. But that's still a really nice yellow. Um, I'm looking forward to playing with that. Um, the only thing I'd say is that when you squeeze too much, it is giving a bit turdy. <laughs> Don't know why I said that. But um, it's not going in perfectly but yeah it's nice and the thing is is that the, they're so reasonably priced um and you get so much product as well um so yeah I've got a bunch of goods in this don't know what I've got in here I can't remember right <laughs> I love that for us um okay so oh I love the way this looks like actual money um stack them up so I've got two different ones of these. So you could get those different colours that they've got, which I'll put on the side. But um, for this, I got two of these. One for me and one for one of my friends. Um, I wanted to go for... Um, okay, so I'll pull them out. There's like... Um, the colours differ a little bit. I don't know if you can see it. So there's like a, like a pink um, colouring on that a little bit, a bit pink and purpley and they can't necessarily see it and there's a bit of a light blue on that one so yeah so let's put out the palettes or oh, whatever I don't want to use her so I'll put it out 
so you can see it. But I've already got like a palette of um, P. Louise's already, and the colours of that come out so well. So, don't need. And this is one of my P. Louise palettes. Yes, it looks bombed out and depleted. Mind your business. <laughs> yes, it looks a bit messy. That's how their colours come out. So they come out really well. Right. Okay, so we're pulling out the... I've literally got the yellow mustard, the mellow mustard already on the packaging hope this one's mine <gasps> cute oh my god it's giving me everything that i want you're all i ever wanted you're all i is this all money oh okay i love this okay so it's got a little lazada sign or whatever on the side here um, on the mirror and then you've got like icon empire priceless bankroll ambition these purples look absolutely amazing look how nice that looks sorry what i want to eat you you look so good um so yeah hold on i'm just gonna double check to see because um my girl wanted a colour and I can't remember. I don't... Can you just imagine? I'm like... <laughs> I, I give her her eyeshadows and I'm like, Hi, by the way, these have already been worn by me. Um, oh, I can't remember which one of us. Like, look... Oh my God, this palette. I hope, I hope it's not this one she wants. I've got a feeling it's this one she wants. But it looks so good. That boss babe... I'm just going to bring that closer to you. Look how good that Boss Babe looks. The palette, not me. <laughs> okay. Oh my God, that's so nice. I'm going to... I'll take some pictures of these. So you can... Like, this is... It's, it's It looks so good. So you've got Boss Babe, Money Moves, Gold Digger, Get Up and Grind level up which looks like a really nice black talk is cheap which is like looks like a really good can i tell you <laughs> don't touch me like that or whatever hustle and payday um yeah so yeah so i got those palettes there okay you definitely need to go back in the box I now wish that I got more of these. I might actually... The thing is, is that I hate palettes where, like, you get, you get them and you only use, like, three colours out of them and then you're like, okay, I don't want to use this again. Um, I would say that my... The previous palette, like, my um, P. Louise Secret Cinema palette, I, I use that quite a bit. Use most of the colours in there. And I'd say that the same for my Novena volume five um palette my palette um that one's like one that i use most of the colors in there because you can use different things for like lips so this is a um from the norvina palette like the eyeshadow and i made it in for like a lipstick because you can use it for whatever okay so let's see what else we've got okay so then we've got a big oh my god i'm just i just love nice pack um packaging this is Watch the Queen Conquer. And I wanted, like, the kind... I like the idea of, like, a little, um... Oh, I didn't even see the way that the colours come off on the side. I wanted, like, a little, um... Alice in Wonderland vibe. So, yeah. So the Queen is the only piece on the board during a chess game that represents a woman. She's the most powerful piece of the game. Oh! Because I thought a bitch I'd say. Sorry. I thought I heard noises. It's literally like. Oh, it's birds. It's like 4 3 30 in the morning. Yes, I am up making videos at 4 30 in the morning. Oh my goodness. I'm definitely gonna. 
So I don't know how to open things like a lady. Um... Oh my god, yeah, I definitely broke it. Because that's the thing. Okay, so we've got... Oh my god. How many times? Can we take a shot of it every time I said, oh my gosh. Okay. Hi, I just want to let you know I love you. Okay. So. Ooh. Uh, okay, so. Um the palette and as you can see this is why I didn't want to um worry about doing the um swatches on the other palettes because we're having them on here my light focuses on whatever it's focusing on the moment so if you see me in the background like a shadow mind your business okay so very excited about working with you um it's literally a chest Lady like it's literally a chessboard what i'm sorry this packaging is so cute that's so cute why would you do that why would you be so adorable okay so it flips over and then we're going for like um our warm like autumnal autumnal colors like oranges like greens greens browns and such love this okay so, if we're talking about how good the colour pickup is of this. Okay, so I want to show you some of the colour pickup and see how it is with this. So, let's go with Boss It Up, which is a pink. Already, it's there on my finger quite well. I always get worried about how things are going to come out on my skin. I'm dark skin. Sometimes it comes up with the colour, sometimes not. Um, so, I'm going to show you on the white and then also off the white. So, this is it on my skin normally. Um, I'm going to show you now. I've kept the white there for a reason. And then um, this is it on the white. So, interesting. I don't know. It Like, on my, on my hand, it looks really... It looks really picked up. I don't know if it if it's showing as much on cam, but it looks very bright here. And I can't see much of a difference between that and the white, which is good because you shouldn't have to rely on that. Although, I mean, it always makes it slap. Um, so let's see what the gold is like because we love a good gold. Um, oh, oh my God. It looks like deliciousness. Don't know if you guys can see that. Um, I'm gonna put that on the hand there and then put that on uh, on the white. It, oh my God, it's actually so nice. So yeah, that's the gold. <laughs> I've literally done this in the most catty way of doing anything, which is slightly chaotic. I'm going to come out looking like the Joker. Okay, so I'm really excited about this orange. I already have a P. Louise orange as well. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm, I'm going to do a few looks with this. Um, there are some, look, there's some of the colours that I feel like would come out like ash. Um, I'm, I always stay away from like pearly yellows or pastel because I'm scared. Um, but P. Louise, yeah. So that's giving me a little bit of ash. I'm going to see. So forfeit in this is giving me a little bit of ash. But I'm going to see how it looks like um, on the face. So yeah, maybe just trying to do a full look with this. And then, um, yeah. So, okay, so that's everything that I've got from P. Louise. Um, definitely, definitely feel like, oh my gosh, right, so how much was that? I'm going to double check. Um, okay, so I, I think that my P. Louise order was, okay. So, um, so yeah, 
Um, my all, everything in this order all together was a hundred and one pounds. Um, the shop the shipment was two pounds fifty. Um, obviously I'm t talking UK prices. I'm not too sure international. Um, the stack 'em up eyeshadow palettes. These ones are eight were eight fifty. Um, I think they were on a deal. I'm not too sure. Um, and then the pink, the the brushes, and pink and ink set, um, are were nine pounds, and um, the angled brush liner was five pounds, and yeah, and the mellow mustard in ink was seven. Oh my god, hello, can you say words? So the <laughs> mellow mustard pink. The Mellow Mustard, having a lisp is a ghetto. Okay, let's start again. The Yellow Mustard ink was £7.25. <laughs> this palette was £36. Do I think this is worth it? Um, oh, still obsessed with this. Love that. That's super cute. Um, oh, yes. <laughs> In short... <laughs> yes um i love this i feel like i would take this and i would be able to work with this and have all the colors that i would need so yeah um super happy with that yeah thank you for watching and oh if i don't speak to you before christmas merry christmas tell me what you think of this look i'm trying to practice like doing some more face looks so i can have some fun with them um next year so yeah all right okay bye